Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming, I'm Brianna. Today we'll be playing through more Crisis Core Final Fantasy VII Reunion. It's gonna be fantastic. But first, Happy New Year! How were your holidays? Over the holidays, I binge listened to a title recommended by the Strange Rebel community called Dark Matter. Thanks to our sponsor, Audible, I started just listening to it while I was driving, but I was enjoying it so much, I started listening to it while I was cooking and walking my dog, and eventually I was just sitting on my couch doing nothing but listening. I normally listen to nonfiction on Audible, like The Path Made Clear by Oprah Winfrey, but this is my first fiction and I am hooked. It was so good. Now Audible has new formats like the Words and Music series, tons of podcasts like my favorite Radio Lab, and The Sleep Collection with meditations and bedtime stories too. Audible is really a one-stop shop. So let Audible help you discover new ways to laugh, be inspired, and be entertained. And new members can try it free for 30 days. Visit audible.com slash strange rebel or text strange rebel to 500 500 to try Audible free for 30 days. Thank you so much to Audible for sponsoring this video. And now let's get on to the gameplay. Enjoy. Hey, Zach. So the war is over. That it is. I'm sure you heard. I ruled. No. I didn't hear. The company reports don't mention you at all. On TV, they only talk about Sephiroth's bravery. But Sephiroth was in B-Unit! Well, our heroes are chosen by the media. That's true. Dreams crushed. Poor Zack. Okay, so let's read our mail, because that's what we've been told to do. President's Declaration. We hereby declare the end of the war with Butai, worthy of notice Sephiroth, soldier first class, whose contributions were instrumental in bringing about a peaceful resolution with a minimum of casualties. The end of this war marks the beginning of distribution and further development of Mako throughout all regions. The Shinra Company is dedicated to these goals and will continue to achieve them by any means possible. And this is from Director Lazard. Soldier members, I want to thank you for your daily hard work. The long war has finally come to an end, all thanks to the heroic efforts by Sephiroth and everyone in Soldier. However, the air around Shinra remains tense. Threats from powerful armed forces and anti-Shinra elements are too numerous to list. We could deem these distortions born out of Shinra's meteoric rise to glory. And we, as members of Shinra, must always face these distortions with integrity. I hope you keep this in your hearts as you continue in your duties. All right. Oh, come on. Cheer up. You know you? what, Kunsel? Get out of here. Not helpful. Uh, I think this is where we're supposed to meet him? I might be wrong. We'll find out. No, I'm correct. Okay. Look at him with his cat eyes. Congratulations. As of this moment, you are promoted to soldier first class. Hype? That's all he's ever wanted? Huh. I thought I'd be happier. Oh. Understandable. Too much happened too fast. Zach, I'm afraid I need your assistance again. Are you pushing another assignment on me? My apologies. Whatever. Oh, he's mad at Sephiroth. Win, Zach. But before that, go to the briefing room and change into a first class uniform. Ah, good. It looks exactly the same to me. I don't know what the difference is. Is that bad? Okay, now that Zack has been promoted to first class, a combat evaluation is given after each battle. Oh no, not a grade scale. I'm going to do badly. Depending on the results, HP, MP, and AP may be restored, so be mindful when fighting. You can do no damage, perfect guard, but I'm bad at guarding. Limit finish, summon finish, magic finish, or ability finish. Okay. I thought I was doing pretty well on my own. Are you Zek? I am. In the flesh. As soldier first class, 
you are now authorized to use Materia Fusion. Whoa! So what do I do? First, open the main menu. You should now be able to select Materia Fusion. Now, try fusing these two Materia. That should give you a general idea of how the process works. One fire and one blizzard, okay? If you have okay. any questions, just let me know. Oh, I'm sure I'll have questions. Can almost definitely not doubt that. Okay, uh, Materia Fusion. Fira and Thunder is Blizzara. That makes sense. Materia created through fusion are usually set at level 1, but when two of the same materia are fused, the higher level will be carried over. When a master level is used, a higher ranking materia may be created, so experiment often. In regards to parameter carryover from materia fusion, the parameter with greater value... I'm sorry, this is like math, and it's making my brain fog over. Example of Materia Fusion Parameter Carryover. I know those words. I know all those words. Um, I swear I'm smart. Um, Materia 1, Fira, Match plus 3. Materia 2, Attack Up, Attack plus 2. Fused Materia, Fira Blade, Magic plus 4. Okay, so 2 divided by 50%, or 2, 50% of 2 is 1, so it'll be 3 plus 1 equals 4. Oh my god, <laughs> so confusing! No! <laughs> okay. Um, I guess we just have to try it. Um... What did he want? Blizzard and fire and blizzard? Okay. Oh, okay, so it just tells you what you're gonna get. So, okay, so I don't have to do that math. Well, why did it make it seem like I had to do that myself? No, it just does it for you. It just shows you what it's gonna become. Oh, okay. Thank goodness. Whew. I thought I had to, like, pull out, like, an old school guide. Like, I was gonna have to consult the walkthrough. Oh man, stress of that. Okay, so forget that. That is too hard. Moving on. Hey now, are you sure you know enough about Materia Fusion? No, but I am leaving. Goodbye. Materia Fusion. You're still, still talking to technology. me. Okay. Some combinations and results have not been tried or discovered yet. That's why we want you to experiment. And if you make a new discovery, let us know. You got it. I won't, but you know what? If I do, I'll let you know. Are changing? Yeah, and I picked up Materia Fusion too. Then return to my office. I'll brief you on the mission. Yes, sir. What do you want, Kunsel? How can I help you, sir? This is an official notification of the change in status for the following personnel. Angeal, killed in action. Genesis, killed in action. Okay, so they're saying that Angeal and Genesis were killed in action, even though we know they just kind of like disappeared. Okay, uh, Genesis, K-I-A, killed in action. Yeah, right. Who do they think they're trying to fool? Just got back from seeing the stage production of Loveless in Midgar. Genesis was a big fan, wasn't he? I usually don't care for classic drama, but it was pretty damn good. The guy is the hero in the original, but the play was more fun from the viewpoint of the girl who helps the guy. When I heard that last line, of course, I'll come back to you. Even if you don't promise to wait, I'll return knowing that you'll be here. Oh man, that's when I just lost it and just started bawling. Okay, so I just want to point out, because I have to, that the guy is the hero, 
But he's like, but I thought it was more fun from the viewpoint of the girl who helps the guy. Not the girl who has her own character arc and is a hero in her own way. No, no, no. The girl who helps the guy. Great. The company has decided to eliminate Genesis and his cohorts. This includes Angeal as well. And you want me to do it? No. The Shinra army will handle it. What about me? They don't trust you. They believe your emotions will hamper your judgment. <laughs> well, of course. Should they? That's why I'm going too. To kill them? Where? Close. Sephiroth, the president. Zack, entrance. Yeah, you got it. Okay, here we go. Why not? We're not overthinking things. We're diving right in. It's 2023. It's 2023 what energy. Good. Soldiers here. Thank goodness. Hurry up and deal with that. That? And what would that be? Uh. Oh, what is this? They look like they belong to Shinra. Activating combat mode. Area. I should probably equip that. Conflict resolved. Oh, thank you. What was that? What? You don't know? That was an intruder neutralization map. Yeah, that's what I thought. So why was it attacking employees? It just went berserk. For reasons unknown. There are others stationed, so deal with them. Okay. But I was ordered to go to the entrance. Poor Zach. He shouldn't be thinking too hard, you know. Uh, ma materia. Okay. Um, okay, maybe I do want equipment. Okay, actually, we do have all of our materia equipped. Okay. There's nothing else here. Materia room? I can't go in there. Okay. Oh, that's. Hey, you all right? He does not look all right. Behind you. Oh, okay. Oh. He's alive. All right. Cool. 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 Activating combat mode. Ah, I took no damage, so I got a little no damage bonus. Sweet. I was close. Did that mech injure you? Yeah. Pathetic, right? A soldier member getting bested by that thing? Hey, even soldier members have their bad days. Well, this is actually one of my better days. <laughs> <laughs> I've never related to anything so hard. <laughs> Wow, today really kicked my butt. And this was a good day. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I deeply, deeply relate to that. Really not that good at fighting. <sighs> you're a soldier, suck it up. If you're bad at something, train harder. Wow, wise Sorry. words from a soldier now. first class. For you. Oh, I got an ether out of it. Okay, great. What a good role model I am. Okay, so I think Entrance. that's it for that. Entrance. Why are 
Shinra weapons attacking the Shinra building. Is that this looks is doing? yeah. That looks like a Genesis Wutai warrior. Activating combat mode. You're in for it now. Here we go. Go, go, go. I have a feeling there's more though. Yeah. I Oh, they just got shot right down. They didn't even Okay. Oh, we're going to have to take them out. We're going to have to. here now. Oh, well, we missed all of them. That was a good thing to do. Miss all of them. Why not? Why not? Okay. And then that one. Get you out of there. And there's more. Ooh. Oh, that's the dodge button. I mean, not the dodge button, the guard button. Yeah, like so, like so, a pro. Rush assault level one, bring it on. Yeah, just hype yourself up and punch him. That's that's the first soldier first class version of this. Yeah. All right, fire actually works pretty well against them. Okay, don't just attack me like that. Brace yourself. Brace yourself. Here we go. I'm guarding against it, but I still don't think that was the right call. It's fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, there we go. Conflict resolved. Sephiroth, the intruders are Genesis copies. There's no doubt. This is Hollander's doing. Who is that? A Shinra scientist who stole the copy tech then vanished. Are you saying that this Hollander and Genesis are working together? Quite possibly. Do you know what they're planning? Hollander sought to head the science department and lost. He's borne a grudge against Shinra ever since. He wants revenge. So petty. And Genesis is supporting the stupid cause? So petty. I don't want to believe it. Well, then don't. Agreed. Now, Zack. Copies have been sighted in Sector 8 as well. Let's go. This is bad. We should split up. Good call. Hold on. I'm a coming. The Oh! Sector jurisdiction. Slick.
You've got to be kidding me! Sung, do something! There's no need for concern. Huh? Okay. The other areas. Midgar's just crawling with nasties. Soldiers having difficulties. Reno, rude. Just say the word. Go. Yes, sir. <laughs> So now we're outsourcing to the Turks. Soldiers being stingy. There's a manpower shortage. Duh. You're a Turk too? I'm Cisne. I'm Zach. Pleasure to meet you. Zach, aren't you on assignment? <laughs> Same objective. Need some help here? I appreciate the offer. Oh, but... how generous. Well, Sung, Zach. I gotta go. All right. Well, that was, <clears throat> that was Sisney. <laughs> we just barely met her and we're like, she's in our brain now. Let's add her to the DMW. And we have heightened emotions about her, no less. Defeat the monsters. Oh, are we going to follow her? Oh, we are not yet. Eventually, probably. Oh, good. That was easy. Fantastic. Conflict resolved. On to Loveless Avenue. Oh, definitely take care of you. Yeah, get out of here, innocent person. I'll take care of this. Oh, well, that worked out. Ooh, we leveled up. Armateria. Thanks, man. You saved me. You're welcome, man. Literally, his name is Man. Oh yeah. Those mask guys causing all that havoc. I think I saw their leader just now. Oh great. He's up ahead on this street. I'd stay clear if I were you. Me, I'm a soldier first class. I will go directly what? towards the That's danger. A token of gratitude. Thanks, man. Uh, were those useful? Mm, they would take away quite a bit of HP, but they would give magic plus five. Mm, I think we're good on that. Oh, we'll help you out too. Okay, don't with your last dying breath do that. Oh, Alright, well we've mastered assault Thank twister, you so much. which is great. Just You're welcome. A really cool older girl came and saved me, but bad guys with big weapons came too. That young lady gave us time to escape by charging out alone. Please, mister, I'll give you my favorite treasure. So please, help that girl. You got it. I yes, love please. that. I love treasure. So I wonder if we want a different materia. Yeah, let's switch out Assault Twister since we have it maxed out and bring in Power Attack. Oh, he's that's really him, okay. Genesis. But who's to say no. you're not a copy? Copies. Oh. Activating combat mode. Read my mind. Okay, don't do that. Yeah, see, I have magic too. 
Okay, don't do that. Okay, don't. I was telling him the whole time, don't do that. And then he did it. That's kind of rude, isn't it? I think that is kind of Activating rude. Combat mode. Nice! We cancelled that out, which was great. We still got hit, but that's okay. Cancelled that out, which is fantastic. We have no MP cost, so that's why I'm just doing fire all over. Over and over and over and over again. Here comes that one wing. The single wing. The swing. Ooh, soundtrack music. When I was a kid, I always wanted to have wings. You know, like an angel. people had wings, they'd be monsters. Wings symbolize freedom for those who have none. They don't symbolize monsters. <laughs> Impressive, soldier first class. You've got skill. Well, unlike the Turks, fighting's our main thing. Here, a little gift for helping me out. I got a new shop. Right, okay. Then. I'm off to the next job. You've got something too, right? Yeah, I do. Until we meet again. Goodbye. Once Sector 8 is clear, come to Mako Reactor 5. Did you find something out? Angeal has been sighted. <sighs> so it's search and destroy? The army is mobilizing, but there's still time. You and I will find them before they we do. And and what? And what? We all want to know. To eliminate them. For real? Oh. Yes, for real. Awesome! We're gonna fail. That's adorable, Zach. Failure. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do we have any mail while we're here? Seems like no. Oh, but we did have new shops, so I just want to really quickly check that out. Ooh, I do love Esuna. Prevents poison, prevents silence, prevents stun. Um, oh, we already have a Nesuna. Okay, well, I don't know. I guess we'll just hang out there then. Ooh, that looks creepy. Oh, that, um, Later. you are really weak to that. Later! Oh, man. Oh, that was amazing. That was fantastic. Is I that only Angel's want that. Place? Oh, yeah, that's weird. It appears Genesis isn't the only one who can be copied.
The company training room. Hmm? We used to sneak in there for fun. When the seconds were out. Genesis. And Jill. And I. You guys were pretty tight. Hmm. I wonder. Flashback? Perhaps? Infinite in mystery is the gift of the goddess. We seek it thus and take to the sky. He's got such beautiful lashes. Ripples form on the water's surface. The wandering soul knows no rest. Loveless, Act One. <laughs> you remember. How can I not, when you've beaten it into my head? Don't take Sephiroth lightly. <laughs> Noted. Sparks for some reason. All hail Sephiroth, huh? Angeal, stay back. I'll take Sephiroth alone. Genesis. The world needs a new hero. <laughs> Come and try. No, really, look at his lashes, so though. So smug. But for how long? <laughs> Everybody loves a good battle sequence. <laughs> oh, they're in the sky? You'll destroy this place. <gasps> That's no way to talk to a hero. Oh, they are destroying that place. a movie oh the theme though oh my gosh of my way! Genesis! Just a scrape. I'll be fine. Don't worry. Even if the morrow is barren of promises, nothing shall forestall my return. Okay. So, was everything So, Genesis right? has something to prove. Yes. 
as far as Genesis was concerned. But... as for Angeal... Angeal? What happened? <laughs> Later, I received one of his famous lectures. About what? Always the same. Discipline, dreams, honor, etc. Haha. <laughs> one of those, huh? So it's true. They're in league with Hollander. How could this happen? Don't open your eyes. Okay, I was... Zoom in. Brighten me. A little bit. I thought it was gonna, like, hey, open its eyes. What are you up to? Um... Where are you? Oh, so much mail. Okay. Preparing against enemy abilities. Make sure to guard. Convert materia you don't need into SP before you pass maximum stock. I don't know if I'm going to be too worried about that. If you acquire the item below, Bahamut's image will be added to the DMW. That would be fantastic. Okay, so that's just all of this. Okay, so these are all the summons. Tonberry! Terrifying. Shop addresses. Each shop has different, okay. Okay, great. Search for clues. I have new mail again. <laughs> From Treasure Princess, recruitment. I'm looking for someone who would go on treasure hunts with me. How would you like to team up? If you're interested, I want to prove, I want you to prove yourself first. Somewhere out in the fields, there's supposed to be a treasure hidden by Shinra's General Affairs Department. If you manage to find it, I'll let you in. You can get your hands on some really rare items by becoming a treasure hunter. Not a bad deal, is it? No, no, I didn't think so. Good luck. Okay. Okay, so that brings the ladder down, but considering we just went down, I don't think we need to go back up right now. But thank you for that, for when we need it in the future. Activating combat mode. Combat mode? Well, I know what to do with you. Look at me guarding. What a professional I am. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Later. <laughs> down again. I'm never gonna get over that. I feel like I traveled back in time when he was like, later! Activating combat mode. Don't cancel my Fira! Look at me. I'm guarding. Professional. Got him. All right. Rude. Conflict oh, yeah. resolved. Conflict resolved. Ooh, stuff. Take. Shinra Alpha, huh? Do we want the Shinra Alpha? What does it do? Vitality plus 40 would be nice, but then we would lose magic and spirit, and I think we're gonna keep those. That's nice to have it.
I don't know why we had to turn that reactor Activating gauge. You can't both jump on me at the same time. Look at how much health that took from me. That was rude. Later. Later. Oh, yeah. God, I love that. Oh, that makes me so happy. All right, we used two potions, but this is the way we need to go. Okay. Mode. Some more combat. Don't poison thrust me. Get out of here. Activating combat mode. Out of the way. Okay. I mean, I pretty much dodged that, so I don't know what you're doing over there. Conflict oh, yeah. resolved. Okay, so that would be down. That's where we need to go. So perhaps we go around. Activating combat mode. Perhaps we get stopped by some combat. Not enough MP, what, what am I supposed to do? Oh, I guess I could have an ether, huh? Okay, well, don't do that. There you go, okay. Ah, there's two of you! Oh, no MP cost, quick, kill it! Kill it with fire! Oh, yeah. Good, <laughs> good. Fantastic. Combat mode. Oh my god, this is so annoying! Oh, okay. Well, that worked out really well, the power attack. That's great. Fantastic. Okay, well, I mean, look, let's lower you because we're here, but I don't think I need to do that. In fact, I think I took the longest possible way through this labyrinth. But you know what? That's how we do it sometimes. So, it's fine. Activating combat mode. More combat. It's fine. What? Don't dodge it. I don't have all that MP. Zach, let's go. Right. I'm ready to be a hero. Zach. Oh yeah. Conflict resolved. Don't think I can go in there. So. Activating combat mode. More combat, no problem. I can deal with that. See, when they both jump on me like that, it really does hurt a lot. It takes a lot of HP. All right, Sephiroth. Good work. Thank you. What is it? Ooh, that's where they're being made. That's unfortunate. There's a monster inside. Is this where they make the copies? 
Probably one of the places. Probably not all of the places. The Ancients Project outline. It is now an undisputed fact that the life form excavated from the Earth is indeed of the ancient race spoken of in legend. Furthermore, history records that these ancients channeled the power of this planet to tear the Earth asunder. Using the cells of the unearthed ancient, we have begun research on creating and mass producing a race with comparable abilities. The primary objective of this research is to significantly reduce Mako excavation costs. The heightened abilities of soldier members are maintained by a delicate balance of various genetic factors. A change in this balance could only be caused by a leak of genetic information, but this is not possible under normal circumstances. This phenomenon is unique to soldier type G. I'm getting woozy. Yeah, don't think too hard. It was shortly before Genesis left. The wound was superficial, but for some reason, Genesis wasn't healing. The man who treated him was... Hollander. Professor Hollander, how is Genesis? The problem is the Mako energy that seeped in through the wound. Is it treatable? First, he'll need a transfusion. You aren't viable. Why couldn't I be the donor? A soldier, type G. Okay. Objective, implant the cells of an ancient into a human fetus to imbue said fetus with the ancient's abilities. It was Hollander's experiment. The result was a normal child, which meant he failed. However... However... However what? You're gonna have to spell this one out for me, if I'm being honest. Project G gave birth to the man we know as Genesis. Okay. Project G. Project Genesis. Contrary to this report, Genesis showed clear signs of change. Degrading? Not only that. Copies? Abominations. S Sephiroth. Hollander, I thought I'd find you here. You want to do something to me, eh? But then, who will stop Genesis and Angeal's degradation? Genesis. You won't take Hollander. <clears throat> Zack, go. Yeah. <clears throat> there is no hate, only joy. For you are beloved by the goddess. Hero of the dawn, healer of worlds. Loveless again, you never change. Three friends go into battle. One is captured, one flies away. The one that is left becomes a hero. A common story. If we were to enact it, would I be the one to play the hero, or would you? It's all yours. Indeed. After all, your glory should have been mine. How petty. In hindsight, perhaps. Now what I want most 
is the gift of the goddess. Interesting. Okay. You won't get away. Where is Aunt Jill? Tell me. I'm gonna have to get him. Activating combat mode. Um, I feel like they did not take that much damage this time. Ooh! Oh yeah! Still feeling a little uh, unhealed over here. That worked out. Alright. Conflict resolved. Good, good, good. Take. Okay, let's make sure that we clear these areas first. Actually, we won't make sure that we clear those areas first. We'll go this way. Ah, hiding behind the door trick, huh? You thought that would... Oh, it did trick me! Zack, come on. You're a soldier first class now. You gotta step it up. Come on, Zack. Alright, is there anything to take in here? Well, there's some battle. G Avenger. Conflict oh, yeah. resolved. Okay, I don't see anything to take in here. But I'm glad we defeated some baddies. Now we'll follow that Hollander. Nope. Now we're going to battle. Mode. That was powerful. I like it. I like it. Good stuff. Okay. I don't know where I came from. I think it was this way. Okay. Activating combat mode. We'll do a little bit more battle. I'm trying to lock onto this guy so that I can take care of him. There we go. No AP cost. Great. We'll use this for sure. Oh yeah. Great. Oh yeah. Activating combat mode. And some more battling. Hey, that worked out pretty well. Conflict resolved. Oh, yeah. Okay, conflict resolved. Oh, I see Hollander, which means... Ah, take. I just saw him. Where did he go? Oh, it canceled it! That's rude. It canceled it again! Dodge that. What are you gonna do about that, huh? I'm gonna do nothing. I'm gonna do nothing about that. You're just gonna die. Alright, Hollander. Activating combat mode. Uh, more of these guys! Later! Oh, that's my favorite thing in the whole world. In the whole world! Nothing better! Oh yeah! 
All right, but let me get this treasure first. Hold on. Okay, let, let me kick some butt first and then get the treasure and then I'll come get you, Hollander. Can't run forever. You certainly can't. How dare you damage me? I was going for that no damage. All right, take. Oh, jump materia. What does that do? Enables aerial attacks. I want to try that out. Now, I like the magic up, but we have mastered it. So I wonder if maybe we can switch that out for jump. Deal with less power for a little bit and just try out jump. Hollander, you can't. Oops. It seems though, Zach, like perhaps he can. Oh, I knew there'd be a take up here. Take! You know what? With his name being Hollander, it really makes me want to eat Hollandaise sauce. All right, let's see how jump works out. Oh, well, not that well. What if I just actually landed it though okay well these things it seems a little like powerful so what if we focused on you first instead because this is gonna be a, a battle of don't hurt me yeah and it hurt me anyway but missiles good that's hurting that's hurting big time okay Ouch, ouch, ouch. Normal attack. Okay. We have to land that. Okay. MP cost zero. Let's just use Fira like crazy. Oh, and cure for sure. And cure, and cure, and cure. Training hard, I hope. You better believe it. Leveled up too. Better All believe right. it. Let's see the results. There, your data from last month. All right, bring it. Me from last month. Oh, that's kind of fun. You can fight yourself. No improvement whatsoever. <laughs> Training's over. <laughs> Maybe Awkward. Even with Sephiroth for a while. Ouch. You should be dead. What are you doing alive? Okay, that's great. MP cost still zero. So I'll still keep using it then. All right, let's just get a, let's guard that. Let's use cure. And then let's just use Rush Assault. Level five, limit break to get this over with. Okay, he's done, fantastic. And he's almost done, fantastic. That worked out well. Okay, great. If I didn't have that limit break, that fight would have taken a lot longer. Hollander, do you understand what you're doing? Uh oh. Working for Hollander now? What is it you're after? World domination. That's not even funny, man. How about revenge? For what? And deal! Oh. I've become a monster. A monster's objective is usually world domination or revenge. You're wrong. 
Those aren't the wings of a monster. Well then, what are they? Angel's wings. I see. Then what should an angel fight for, Zack? What do angels dream of? Angel. Angels dream of one thing. Please, tell me. To be human. Defend yourself! I am so intrigued. And at the same time, I don't understand. You know? Um I just I want to know what that's all about. Mom? I I want to help out a friend, but I don't know how I can do it. Hello. Mom? Hello? Hooray! Heaven? Not quite. <laughs> it's a church. Hey. Hmm? An angel? No, I'm Aerith. Her fell music. from the sky. Huh? Scared me. So you saved me, huh? Not really. Hello. That's all I did. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Aerith. I'm Zach. I have to repay you somehow. Don't worry about it. No, no. Hmm. Aha. Hey, how about one date? <laughs> what is that? Don't be silly. Uh. <sighs> Stop. Don't step on the flowers. Excuse me? Normally, people are more careful with flowers. Well, I guess I'm not normal. Oh. You don't see a lot of flowers in Midgar. They're like luxury items around here. They only grow here. Although, I planted some outside my house, too. <laughs> if I were you, I'd sell them. Hmm? Midgar is full of flowers. Your wallet's full of money. Midgar full of flowers. Wallet full of money? Never thought of it that way. There she is, everyone. There's our girl. There's so much good stuff there um, with her and in that scene. <laughs> um. <laughs> it's 
It's so emotional because I can't help but not only think about the time I spent recording this scene and how seen this, this beautiful is on its own, but then the time that I spent working on it and then the time that we experienced the church scene in Final Fantasy VII Remake and how long ago I recorded for that and how similar these scenes are that Zack falls from the sky into her church and so does Cloud in Final Fantasy VII Remake It's just so... <laughs> it's crazy because it feels almost like... I wish there was a word that fit it better than nostalgic. But it's almost like you can feel yourself in different times at once. And it's like wistful. And it's so ethereal, that feeling. It's so interesting, because nostalgic now doesn't really cover that word, or that feeling, you know? It's very surreal, it's very transcendent. Those words are, are true, but there's no word to encompass all of that, you know? But that's how it feels, it's a very, like, rich feeling. Um, especially for people who even played Final Fantasy VII way back when, to have experienced Cloud fall through that church in that time, and then to get to see it in 2020 with Final Fantasy VII Remake, and then to get to see it, well, and then to get to see it in Crisis Core in 2007, then to see it in Final Fantasy VII Remake, and now to see it now, it's interesting that they chose to remake these games this universe and this characters when there's already in the in these games so many almost shot for shot redos and so it it feels almost like parallel realities like blurring between the lines you know it's really really interesting um but it's it's beautiful so so zach falls through the sky just like cloud did or Cloud falls through the sky just like Zack did, because this is technically a prequel. And immediately looks at Aerith and says, an angel? <laughs> and Aerith goes, not quite. Um, and there's some really interesting moments here in just one single scene that give you such insight into Aerith's character and how she began, because in Final Fantasy VII and Final Fantasy VII Remake, you know Aerith first as the flower seller. She's the girl selling flowers um, in Midgar. Um, and now you see that that idea came from Zack. Aerith wasn't doing that before she met Zack. So that's kind of the origin of her as a flower seller, is, is that's Zack's idea, is you should, you should sell these flowers. And in my head, Aerith is enamored with the idea of Midgar being full of flowers um, because I think she she wants Midgar to have that beauty um, and you have this really interesting beautiful moment of Zack saying well I'm gonna have to repay you for saving me um, how about one date and Aerith goes what is that don't be ridiculous, because that's not something that Aerith thought of. That wasn't Aerith's, that's not where Aerith's mind was, but that's immediately what Zack suggests is a date. And if you remember in Final Fantasy VII and Remake, Aerith says, one date ought to do it. Aerith suggests the date to Cloud. And so imagine how it must have been having Aerith and Zack have this moment, 
And then when Cloud does fall for, through her ceiling, dressed almost exactly the same, imagine how it must be for Aerith to look at him and go, ooh, I've been here before. <laughs> Man, this story just hits so hard. <sighs> um. So really, really beautiful. A very different version of Aerith here um, than you know her previously. Um, she's a little bit younger, um, which was a challenge as a voice actor. And um, she definitely doesn't have that same playfulness. Um, because I think that that's something that she develops. So a really beautiful scene, really impactful scene. Um, and I just, playing this scene brings me right back to the moment I first found out that they were calling me in to revoice the lines for this game. Um, the Previous voice acting for Aerith in the original Crisis Core was fantastic and beautiful, and she's so talented. Um, but to be able to bring, hopefully, the best of that, and also a little bit of my own personal, um, I don't know, vibe, <laughs> feeling to that, um, and my love for the character, just a really, really, really special opportunity. And I'm so, so grateful. Because like, it's so cool, you guys. Like, it's just, I feel so lucky. <sighs> I love this character so much. And it's just so awesome that I get to share moments like this with you all. Truly, truly, truly. <sighs> oh, I gotta take a moment. Every time that I know that these scenes are coming up, I'm like, I feel pretty chill right now. I feel pretty relaxed, like. <laughs> But man, the second that music hits, it's a whole different ball game. <laughs> you know? Let's see what Aerith says. The exit? That door. Going already? No. Then look at the flowers a little more. Look Stop. at them, but don't step on them. <laughs> I said don't step on the flowers. I'm sorry. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Okay, what if we just talk to you one more time? The exit? That door. Okay, it's the same. Going already? Yeah, I should go. Well, thanks again, Aerith. Yeah. Are you always here? Yeah. So, where are you going? Hmm, don't know.
take you. <laughs> Where? Hmm. Don't know. <laughs> you just want to spend more time with me. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> She's so earnest. She just admits it. She's like, yeah. We're under the plate, right? Sector 5. The slums. Yeah. Main Street's over that way. There's lots of people. And you can go above. Ah. Well, I should be good once I make it there. All right? Lead the way. Okay, let's go. I have to say though, this Aerith's footwear, extremely impractical, but very 2000s. Mail from Shinra News, personnel announcement. Effective today, Zack Fair has been promoted to Soldier First Class. Gotta print that one out and stick it on the fridge. It's one we're proud of. Do you think flowers would grow here? Hmm. No. Probably not. Around here, you'll find junk that above plate folks throw away. Well, it may just be junk to you, but for us, it's a key source of income. It's still a ways. I'm catching up. I just had to talk to that guy about junk. You know. You think flower? No, I don't think they would. We talked about this. Ah! Monsters! Oh, there we go. Zach, let's run! Don't worry about it. I'll protect you. I've got this. You've got this? Oh, yeah. Stay back, okay? Activating combat mode. Oh, don't hit him with that, that's for sure. Okay, so jump attack worked all right. Nice, and I took no damage. Making myself look good in front of Aerith. <laughs> You're so strong. <laughs> strong. Like a monster, right? Zack, what's wrong? Nothing. Now, let's move. Hey, I looked good, right? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. What? Don't know. <laughs> Come on, flatter me. <laughs> All right, Zach, let's go. <laughs> uh, uh, hello. It's pretty cute that now Dano is her way of being playful with Zach. So she's kind of developing that playful nature with him. Um. And Zach is like, come on, I, I, give me something. And Aerith is like, let's go. <laughs> Which is so polar opposite from the way she is with Cloud because Cloud is the moody one, like all business. And Aerith is the one that's like, my hero. Shouldn't we get going? More monsters will come. Hey, wait. You're right here. So, here we are. Yep. Hmm. Something wrong? The slums look just like any other town. <laughs> of course. Lots of people live here. Hey, inside that gate, there's a market. There's so many great shops there.
It's kind of stuffy here. You okay? Oh, I know why. There's no sky here. Uh, we don't need this sky. You're under this plate all the time. You normally miss seeing the sky, no? Sorry, I'm not normal. How's that? The sky frightens me, like it's sucking me in. Weird, right? Normal is overrated. You think so? I know. One day, I'll show you a pretty sky. <sighs> it won't be scary. Trust me, you're gonna love it. Hmm. And that right there is why a prequel can hit so dang hard. Because if you've played Final Fantasy VII, Final Fantasy VII Remake, you know that that day does not come. That Aerith does see the sky, but Zack is not the one who shows it to her. And she doesn't like it. And so you have this beautiful moment where you realize where it's laid out for you. That's what makes a prequel so great is it adds additional context to the original source material. So you have Aerith, you know, in her moment of looking at the sky when she gets out of Midgar, she's thinking of Zack. At least that's my interpretation in my head. It just breaks your heart. Ah! <sighs> Are the slums strange to you? Oh, Kunsel, what do you have to say now? Hollander's t-shirt. It seems Hollander's favorite t-shirt is the one with a logo of Benora's famous canned apples. Can a guy love apples that much? Or do you suppose he has other ties to Benora? Apparently, with all the confidential information they handle, guys in the science department aren't allowed to leave the company even if they screw up or lose out on the rat race, and that puts them under a lot of stress. Maybe Hollander's t-shirt helps him relive some, relieve some of that, huh? What is the relevance, Kunsel? Why are you just sending me mail all the time? Hey, wait! Here's the famous playground. I really like the park a lot. Not as much as the church, of course. I really like the park of Do you have the kidlets running around the park, even though this park looks a little dangerous, but it's cute to see Zach and Aerith here together, considering the nostalgia that this <laughs> this dang little gymnasium has, you know? like an interesting place. Yeah. Want to take a look? Oh! Oh, sorry. Be careful, huh? Okay. Sorry again. Man, that hurts. Huh? Wait. What the? What's wrong? 
my wallet's gone. <gasps> oh no. <sighs> <sighs> that little brat. He just stole my wallet. Aerith, wait here, okay? I'm gonna go catch that kid and get my wallet back. Bruno's his name. Bruno? You know his name? Yeah, I know him. Just a little. He doesn't do things like that. But... If he really stole from you, I'm sure he had good reason. Hey, I'll go look for him. Zack, you wait here. Mm. All right, I'll wait here. But I'm pretty antsy. Yeah, I know. That obvious? <laughs> So of course, Aerith advocating That's for the step. good and everyone. No matter the reason, I'll have to give him a good scolding. Always doing the squats. Ugh, That's Always. It. It's my wallet that was stolen. I'm gonna look for Bruno too. I think he went that way. All right, off we go. If you need materia, you've I am a carpenter that travels all over. Anything from gifts for your if you need except Okay, but we have no wait. Director Lazard has something to say about the children in the slums? Soldier members, I thank you for your daily hard work. On the ground, beneath our aerial city of Midgar, and in the shadow of its plates lie the slums. They also symbolize one of Shinra's distortions. There are reports of children forming gangs in the harsh environment they call home. To look away from this will surely cast a large shadow on Shinra's future growth. It is my hope that we remember that we members of Soldier can rise up to address this distortion. Hmm, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. You look pretty busy. Thanks, I'm looking for my wallet. Hey, you look like a kid. Did I already talk to you? We're still setting up the number guessing game. Four. Okay. I guess I don't get to play. Mm, I guess we'll go this way. Did he go out from here? Hey, you there! You there! Did a kid come running this way? A little boy? A little boy? Don't know. Although, children never come this way. I see. Got your pocket pick, did you? Huh? Happens all the time here. But you're gonna have a hard time finding the thief on your own. Ask folks around here nicely, and they might help you. Yeah, that's a good point. Right. I'll ask around here, for starters. Aha! Uh -huh. Then I'll start with you! Let me think. I just saw a boy running frantically by the accessory shop. To the accessory shop I go. Alright, accessory shop. Excuse me. Welcome. What do you need? Uh, no. I'm not shopping. All right. I'm looking for a kid named Bruno who took my wallet. Maybe you've seen him around? Fifth like arm. This. Never seen him. He looks but like what? I'll keep an eye out. You're the man. Thanks. What did you draw him a picture? <sighs> Where did he go? There he is! Hey, mister! That's him! Get him! Whoa, Why would whoa. he get him? This kid's pretty fast. Hey, what's the deal? Ah, uh, he's gone. Yeah, sorry. I'm really not that quick on my feet. You had no intention of chasing him. Who would, honestly? No, that's not true at all. <laughs> no, no, on, no. Man. Zach! Hey, Aerith. Did you find him yet? 
Not yet, but give me time, please. Okay. Guess we continue asking. You already said that. Oh, let's talk to you, sir. Excuse me. Got a minute? What is it? I'm looking for a kid named Bruno who took my wallet. Maybe you've seen him around? He looks like this. Sure, I'll help you. He looks like Bruno, this. Bruno, you said? Yeah, no problem. You're the man. If you see him, it'd be great if you could catch him too. Where did he go? There he oh. is! Hey, mister! That's him! Get him! Yeah, he uh, had no intention of he helping you either. <laughs> I did try to grab hold of him. Did you? Did you? Unfortunately, he managed to steal my most prized materia. Ooh, and this well, kid. Once he used it, there was no chance. You too. You didn't even try to chase him. Come on now. That's not true at all. Come on, man. Come on, I man. If still looking. All by herself. What about you? Nothing? What about you? All right, lady. Are you going to just leap across the counter to catch him? Don't lie. Hey, excuse me. I'm looking for a little boy named Bruno. <laughs> he looks like this. He looks like this. I haven't seen... <laughs> Wait, I did see him. Really? That way, I think. That way? Yes, Man. Yes, way down there. Zach, they are giving Great. you the Thanks. runaround. Hey. Wait. He's over by you! <sighs> He's gone! Hey lady! What gives? <laughs> I didn't mean to trick you! I just have really bad eyesight. Come on, man. Come on, oh, man! I see. I'll come back. Hmm? Hey, Aerith! Did you find him yet? Um, no. But give me more time. I'll find him. Man, will we? Will we actually find them ever? Y you, you. Me. Oh no! Never mind. I'm just a Shinra trooper on patrol. That's not suspicious at all. Not even a little bit. Okay. Hey there. I'm looking for someone. A little boy named Bruno. Yeah, I know Bruno. We don't talk we about Bruno, though. Badly. I'll bring him here for you, okay? You will? Yeah, stay right here. All right. I'll be waiting. Hmm. You better do some squats. You're gonna be here a while, I'm guessing. Have I been tricked? Zach's like, huh, I just don't know yet. It's happened three times so far, but I'm just not sure. Ugh, that's it. How far did she have to go? Huh? Hey! That's the kid who took... Oh, no. You talk too soon. You know, I was just about to catch him. Right. Weren't you trying to help him get away? No, I wasn't. That's so mean. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, hey. man! Hey, Aerith. Did you find him yet? That boy is really fast. <laughs> so I'm gonna guess that's a no. 
All right, this is a very prolonged um, experience of trying to get this wallet back. Aerith, how goes? Zack. <laughs> There's no need to look so worried. It's just bad luck. Hey, why don't we look together? Uh, but... Don't worry about it. I'm not gonna yell at him straight from the top. I'll ask him why he did it. And I'll forgive him if it was for a good reason. Really? Yes, really. Okay, let's go look. Yeah, but we still have no leads. If Bruno needed money, he should still be around here. Yeah. Then, you stay here and keep an eye out. I'll go take a look around town. Let's try that, okay? Let's look together. All right, let's split up. <laughs> I don't know about this chain of events. I don't know about them. Aha, I found you. Get him. Whoa. Okay. No more running. Get him, Aerith. Finally. All right. You know what you did was bad, don't you? You should never steal from people. Zack. <sighs> because it's very, very wrong. Now, tell me why you did it. None of your business. What you- <sighs> He's not wrong. Bruno, did you really steal? Yes. I see. So why did you do that? Mm. Mm. You know, Aerith believed in you. No matter what I said, she insisted you're a good boy. You can shut me out, but tell Aerith the truth. Do you need money? Tell me why. I need medicine, but... My wallet was eaten by a monster. That's why I took this guy's wallet. I thought, if he's your friend, he might give me a break. Bruno, this was bad. You know that. Don't do it again. Okay. Okay, good. Now we're friends again. Zach, you agree? You believe in him, so, yes. Thank you. I'm sorry. But there's still the issue but of the wallet you know medicine, right? and the medicine. Yeah, it's for my grandpa. Oh, we get a choice. I'll get the wallet back. Huh? Really? Leave it to me. But it's dangerous. Don't you worry. Monsters around here are cake. Okay, but I'm going too. No, it'll be fine. Just let me handle it. Stay here. She just wants to hang out with you. The monsters should still be on the path that goes to the park, I think. Here, take back your wallet. I think you're going to need it. All right. He thinks we're going to need our wallet back, huh? I think we went the wrong way. I think we're going this way. All right, it's monster killing time. Um, the park is this way. Hey, you! Get back inside the gate now! Why? Monsters coming out of the park in droves! I can handle it. The park. All right, that's got to be them. It's not all right! Everyone's fled! It's dangerous. <laughs> we have to turn back now. He's Sorry, trying to save Zach's life. Money, so I have to go over and collect. What? What the hell are you talking about, guy? Relax, relax. Don't worry about me. You know, you should get behind that gate yourself. 
Okay, now, I remember when we were fighting the monsters in this area before, we really wished that we had Blizzard. So I'm gonna switch out Jump for Blizzard. And then you have it. Great. Towards danger! Here we go. This is them. Bruno's wallet, here I come. Activating combat mode. Ah, it's a good thing we have Blizzard! Ah, good, 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 good. Don't attack me, that is rude. I mean, we can use Hellfire, but I don't know that it's gonna... Why are we stuck? Oh, we're stopped, okay. These things are probably very resistant to fire. All I gotta hope for is that they don't bounce it around like those other guys. Because I don't want to get hit with my own hellfire, you know? Okay, did some damage. And they're still alive. Yeah, that checks out. Ouch! Take that! Worm C. Oh, here we are. One wallet. Is the money still inside? Whoa! That's way more than I have. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Zacky. Wow! You really got it back! Amazing! Ugh, it's so sticky. Okay, let's not Stop complain. Complaining. You're welcome. At least you got it back. Zach and I said the same thing. Oh. Were you okay? No problem at all. Piece of cake. Thanks a lot, mister. Call me Zach. If you need more help, just ask. You don't need to steal anymore. Hmm. Thanks, but... Thanks, but I live in the slums. Bigger money problems than me. <laughs> well, maybe so. But hey, just you wait. Aerith and I, we're gonna make a fortune. Huh? We're launching Operation Midgar Full of Flowers, Wallet Full of Money. <laughs> yes, Midgar Full of Flowers and Wallet Full of Money. Aerith, for real? Yeah, for real. That's why, if you're in trouble, we can help you. All right. I'll come talk to you. Okay, mister. Aerith, thanks. <laughs> Zach is like, hey, call Zach. me Zach. He's like, Did mister, you anyway. Selling the flowers? Of course. There's no turning back after this. I know. Let's make a wagon. A wagon? Yes, a flower wagon. With a wagon to carry lots of flowers, you could sell them all over Midgar. Hmm. Oh, not feeling it? No, no, it's great! Let's do it! Let's do it! One flower cart coming right up. And that's where we have to end today's episode. I'm so sorry we had to end it there, but there's definitely more amazing stuff to come. I mean, we have this whole game to get through, okay? And we're gonna do it. And I'm really excited about it because I'm having so much fun with it. I'm just ecstatic. It's unreal to be involved in a game like this that people like. Like that feeling is just fantastic. So thank you all for sharing your passion for the game with me. And, um, yeah, I'm just super, I'm super, super grateful. I'm really feeling it right now. So thank you all so much. Um, please remember to like the video if you enjoyed it. Share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, please subscribe to Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. That's all. I love you all.